Right now we're in the lower 80s area wide except Daytona Beach. The airport reporting 78 there with a gusty east breeze. 24 hour temperature change. It is noticeably warmer out there today. We don't have that high cloud canopy like we had yesterday. So more sunshine, not quite as strong of a breeze out of the northeast, and that's spelling some slightly above normal temperatures, but humidity levels remaining in check. So overall, not too bad of a day. Our average is 78 this time of the year. We're headed up to around 84 along the I 4 locations, back toward the villages at 83 today, and we'll be in the lower 80s. At the beaches. Again, that rip current threat is running moderate. Moderate chop for boaters, too, with those gusty winds. Seas at three to five feet. And we're going to keep this pattern going through at least the middle part of the week. Looks like by Thursday, those winds taper down a little bit, but we'll also have to deal with some rain in our beach outlook at that time. So, hour by hour, we'll just say breezy and warm, three o'clock uh, temperature of 83 uh, into the downtown area. And then by nine o'clock, I'm going to mention a coastal shower out there, but nothing uh, getting too far inland. There's 9, 10 p.m., a couple of these showers trying to come ashore in Brevard County. As we wake up tomorrow morning, one or two showers along the coast, a possibility as those easterly winds. Start to turn a little more out of the southeast. We'll increase the moisture just a hair more and bring a couple of showers back inland. Our overall rain coverage, though, about 10% today, 20% tomorrow. It does go up a bit on Wednesday because here comes our next front. It's not going to have much cool air attached to it. It's going to be a slow mover. So by Wednesday into Thursday, our rain chance creeping higher. The question is Friday, can that front go ahead and press south of us in time for the upcoming weekend and bring those temperatures down a little bit and dry us out? We'll have the latest, of course, first at four as we get the new model forecast in. Let's send it back to you.